The hot talk of the day is Alembic Pharmaceuticals. Ticker symbol is APL LTD. First, we will see the disclaimer. The analysis is for education purpose only. Please do your due diligence or consult a financial advisor before taking any position in the stock. Before we go to the analysis, I humbly request every one of you to please click the like button as it will help the YouTube algorithm to promote my videos. Also, if you have not subscribed to my channel, please take the time to subscribe now. Also click the bell icon so you get notified whenever I post new videos. I have already posted plenty of videos on hot stocks which are available in the playlist titled Hotspot Stocks. Please visit my channel and view those videos also. Thank you. Now we go to the analysis. <coughs> the chart we see, let me remove the watermark. Okay. The chart we see is the weekly chart of Alembic. The stock made a high of 1148 sometime in December 2020 and has been falling since then. It reached a low of reached a low of 687 in February sorry in February 22 years. Even as on today it is at the same level. The closing price today is 692. Okay. Means it touched the low, went a little bit above and is back at the same level as we speak. As of today, it is at the lowest point, the hot spot point. Okay. So to say. Now, I am of the opinion the stock has correction for the stock is over. I mean the down, down trend is over and the uptrend should start any time. So, we are the right level to take position in the stock. That is my view. Okay. I have seen uh, seven independent technicals converging at the current price level. We will see each one by one. First is the SNR zone. Okay support come resistance zone so we can have a closer look you see at this price level here it got rejected acted as resistance fell off then went above to test resistance again fell again it touched here so went went up but could not go past it so it acted as resistance again it acted as resistance here came down now the this time it managed to give a big breakout and then the stock is back at the same level. In fact, it came here in March and now again back at the same zone. Okay. The next one is the curved trend line. I have drawn the curved trend line with the from the May 18 low and then connecting the March 2020 low, COVID low. Okay, You connect this and then extend the curve. See where it goes? The current level. Okay, That is the curved trend line. The next one is the 61.8 Fibonacci retracement which is the golden ratio. You can see this white line crossing through the current price point. As we speak, we are at 61.8% level. Now, the next one is the Fibonacci extension of this A leg. I will draw this ABC. See, this is the ABC correction move. So, we are at 127.2% Fibonacci extension of this A leg. Okay. The next one is the yellow channel which I have drawn connecting the low point and the high points. 
these two high points two or three high points and then the lowest point and the low point here see how beautiful channel it is and now we are at the same level here it was a good support but here in covid due to covid it broke a little down but came back immediately here also if you see it is only a flash it is a week only the stock intra week went down but came back the same week so these are called picks so we can ignore that so the real support is the channel bottom and we the channel yellow channel we can see it crossing through the current price point okay now we are bringing up another channel the white channel connecting the low point and the high point and then the connecting the present low point okay we can see how beautifully this red channel is crossing through the high point how it has acted as resistance here you see resistance here so it is a very valid channel so that is also causing through passing through the current price point the next and the, the last one the seventh element of support is the pitchfork market geometry tool now it has become too much cluttered so maybe i will switch off some layers to bring up some clarity okay i will switch off all now you are seeing only the pitchfork with the white pitchfork now this uh, yellow line that you are seeing is also a median a median of the lower half of the pitchfork that is also a support okay all these lines are actually medians this is called the central median the, the one at the center the one at the top is called the upper median the one at the bottom is the lower median and these two are the warning lines when it the price goes out of the pitchfork that becomes warning line so the this yellow line is also a valid support that is also a median that is dividing this lower half of the pitchfork you can see it, earlier it cost support here now it is also there okay that is the now i will put the hot spot and bring up all the elements so you can have a visual look how all are falling in place okay it looks a bit cluttered but we have seen each one by one so all these elements are crossing through the current price point that's why i call it hot spot okay now before i wind up we need to talk about the target okay for that again i will switch off all except this yellow channel i will keep because i will need it all other elements i will switch off okay now we are seeing this yellow channel we can clearly see the price is riding within this channel from here it started went up to hit the high came back to hit the low base of the channel again struggled here for a bit and then went up again you see to touch this line and now we are back here now where it will go the target the target will be again the top point of the the top edge of the yellow channel now to know the target i will do this sorry this red channel i have drawn connecting this previous low point and the high point and the current low point you see that's a vertical channel the point where it cuts the yellow top edge of the yellow channel that is the target this green button that i have drawn that is the target for okay that is about how much 1420 that is the target and the target should come in march 2025 okay okay but i am not 100% sure whether the time timing will happen but i feel it will okay let's see that is to be tested okay that is the target and it should come in march okay now uh, how i Uh, decide this is based on the past for example i will draw another channel this blue channel forget about this portion okay supposing you were here at this point okay 
the stock went up came back and we are here for example and if you are a wave analyst you can easily decide uh, and come to know that this is the uh, low point of this abc move because you see if you saw if you put the 100 fibonacci projection you see it comes at 100 percent see 100 percent i will remove this 127 to be clear we don't need that okay see how exactly it is at 100 percent measured move ab equal to cd so if you are an elliott wave analyst you would have come to know that this correction okay is over okay so we now have three points this point this point and three point we need three points to make a channel okay so these three points are enough huh, to form this yellow channel so at that point of time you would have drawn this yellow channel and you know the top edge the stock whenever it hits the top edge that's going to be the target okay now again at which point it will uh, hit to know that you should draw this blue channel connecting the low and the high and this point where it cuts where this blue channel cuts the L, uh, cuts the yellow channel that is your target see exactly how it happened so supposing you bought here your target is clear crystal because you have you would have drawn this yellow channel you could have drawn this blue channel also and the meeting point is your target and that is the same basis which i am doing now I am connecting these two points and the low point, connecting a, making a vertical channel and where it cuts the yellow channel, that will be our target. See how, this is how it happened, it, this has happened in the past, this is going to happen in the future, okay. So that is my analysis, but as usual, this price is not going to come in one go, probably it will go and hit the median, red median, that could be our target whichever point it hits maybe 1000 level or whatever or maybe 1050 well, wherever it hits the at whatever price level it hits the median that should be our first exit point because then we will have a b wave of correction once the b wave is complete then we should again enter to ride till this target of 1439 okay this is my analysis please share my video with your friends and if you have any comments, please do let me know. Thank you very much.